Many parents of children who suffer seizures swear by CBD. They say that cannabis extract curbs the number and severity. Well, tonight, Mackenzie O'Keefe reports researchers at CSU want to know if it has the same effect in dogs. And doggies? Pam Eulenkamp has two cuddly cuties, Ferguson and Sammy. Yep, him and Sammy are both, they're both brothers now and they like each other, sort of. <laughs> the two travel with Pam wherever she goes. He knows what it means to go for a ride. <laughs> Going for a ride used to be a lot harder. Ferguson has epilepsy. He had about two or three seizures a day. The seizures came so often and were so violent that Pam took this video. She said Ferguson would shake like this for five to 10 minutes at a time, and often it took an hour for him to recover. Well, it's really scary because um, you think your dog is in total pain. And so we do an MRI of the dog's brain. CSU veterinarian Stephanie McGrath studies epilepsy in dogs. And so we're really kind of looking for the, in, in search of the ideal treatments. Now she's at the forefront of research into the effects of hemp-based cannabinoids on epileptic dogs. Uh, well, if it's potentially working for pediatric epilepsy, why not try it for canine epilepsy? Ferguson was among the first patients in this study. First of all, his seizures went down. It took about two weeks, maybe three, to like fully affect and it, they, they went to about two or three a week. A dramatic difference for a pooch prone to debilitating convulsions on a daily basis. And he became happier. McGrath still has to study dozens more dogs before she can draw any final conclusions about CBD oil in dogs, but she's hopeful. Um, we haven't seen anything um, that's been uh, adversely affecting our dogs. Pam is already a believer. I just think that it could help a lot of dogs. Dogs like Ferguson, who is living a much better life. I'm Mackenzie O'Keefe, covering Colorado First. Dr. McGrath is still enrolling dogs for her epilepsy study. We have a link to sign up at our website, cbsdenver.com.